Salate e Salerno. is well guarded by the Red Hand. The Order has a stake in these docks. seizes cargo and resells it through merchants in the marketplace. The ones involved bear black cloths and may be able to get their attention by showing some silver around the marketplace. Seized exotic wares. These are worth plenty. Something that could be on the Red Hand's agenda. Accumulating wealth. Cupcake market. I'll flash some silver to the merchants. That should get their attention. Keep your focus. There was trouble at the depot earlier. What do you mean, trouble? I don't know for sure, but the needle is calling for more protection. Meet me here at nightfall. We will go see him together. Those guards will return after dark. You might be able to follow them to the needle. <laughs> Hear me, friend. I have a haul of silver that will sink my ship. Can you help me spend it? Keep it down, would you? You'll get yourself killed flaunting like that, especially around here. What good is a market if I cannot sniff around its stalls eager to spend my gains? You wanna let go of your silver? Try the narrow alleys. Now be gone! gives you a hard time. Remind them just who it is they work for. Oh, with pleasure. Hi, friend. I have a hoard of silver I'm making to spend. Can you help me? What have you got? I have nothing left to trade. But Coppergate Market is the right place. Ask around. You'll find someone who'll bend an ear. My thanks. I hear this marketplace sees its fair share of silver path through. I have something that may interest you. You will want to speak to Grigori. The Dark Master? Sorry. Who are you? Someone who wants to do business. With Grigori. I don't know your face. And I've said too much already. Please, go. Psst. Psst. Did I hear you talking about silver? I'm looking to spend a large sum, not fork it over to some street beggar. Oi! I'm no beggar, you dolt. I'm with the big dogs. You mean the needle? You have something he wants. If you truly want to make a trade, head to the statue near the east gate. I shall. Watch yourself around here, young one. Oh, me? <laughs> Please. I have a bigger sword than a lot of them.
Sorry I was late. The lady. Uh, you know Have you any wine for sale? Just hurry, There's will you? Area drop we have rounds to make. If I follow them, they should lead me to the needle. Shame. I could do with a cup. But alas, this feast is the talk of the town. I am eager for it. Good man, that Alden. There must be another way in.
I'm not surprised to find you creeping down here. You! You don't belong down here! We run a clean dark in Jorvik. I believe those were your words. And yet here I find you swimming in silver from all the wares you've seized. Are you the Needle, or just another of his pawns? You have it all wrong. The fabric of this world has been used up, torn. Shredded, you see. Someone must be there to stitch it back together. Someone with a firm yet steady hand, who can thread a needle. Someone like me. You are a shit poet, but at least my question is answered. <laughs> yes, well, we all have our weaknesses. Yours appears to be the iron between us. I think your men are going to stop me. I would not undermine them so. The Red Hand are loyal to our cause, which is more than I can say for the merchants. Make it quick! Meet me in the marketplace when you are done! Hang! You Fresh game to hunt! Go! Fight smart! Come, come, walk with me. It is good to walk. <laughs> Gregory. Good to take in the air. The sights, the sounds, the smells. Please, Gregory, I, 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 I didn't think you'd mind. It was just a few coins. Shh, 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 shh. I understand. It's not your fault. It was mine for thinking you had anything but empty air between your ears. 
With all the silver I've given you, I have nothing left to feed my children, let alone myself. Please, understand. Oh, dear God. Merchants of Jorvik, I promised you a future rife with opportunity. And what was the one thing I asked in return? Do you remember? Loyalty. Loyalty! Let this serve as a lesson, should any of you think it a good idea to threaten my operation. I run this operation. I'm thinking you do as you're told. It's funny. As a child, I thought of snow as the tears of God, frozen by our sins. Weak with hunger, I stared into the sky, hoping it was me he wept for. Me he sought to save. But God did not save me. The vault did. He took me to a fine house. Gave me hearty meals, a warm bed. For the first time, someone extended a hand, showed me kindness, compassion. And it was then that I made a vow. I vowed to never turn my back on he who was there for me when God was not. So you served the bolt, knowing full well what he was a part of. The Order made our paths intersect. I owed them a debt, and I repaid it by saving this city from its own destruction. A life debt is a strong motivator. It took hold of this one's Hugard, drove it, and never let go. Yet not with the same compassion you were shown. Too many have suffered by your hand in pursuit of this course. You're right. Perhaps I deserve this debt. But I am but one cog in a large wheel. One that still turns unhindered. Not for long. Where you have gone, there will be no tears waiting for you.
seal. I've seen it before on the council grounds. I should show this to Lufina. this works? Fix a problem or two for us? You get a reward! Come back any time, my friend! What news do you bring? The needle will never sting again. Well done, Neivor. Who was hiding behind the name? My love, there has been an attack at the markets. The Dockmaster, Grigory, is dead. The needle. Sold off the ware as he ceased to collect silver for the vault. He had no such authority. Why would anyone believe him? The Council Seal. That rat. This is getting out of hand. How he was able to obtain this is concerning. I must return and prepare for the Yuletide Feast, but I will do so with a bent ear and a keen eye. Be safe. One down, two left. The Christian text will lead to another. I am sure of it. Search the archives.
Thank you, Audun. I will leave with peace at once. Of course. A4, isn't it? What brings you to our archives? I've come to ask about these Christian texts. Lufina tells me the Red Hand is stealing them. Mm, and destroying them? I fear they will attack these archives next. The Abbess here has offered to bring the texts somewhere safe. She's been working diligently on this matter. You flatter me, Lord. I only wish to help. Abbess Ingeborg, this is Eivor, our honored guest from the south. Eivor has offered to help rid Jorvik of the Red Hand. How can I help? An abbess does not strike me as a suitable choice against a gang of ruthless bandits. It is my duty to protect the role of Christianity in our lives. Texts like this Gospel of Matthew were created for more than just perusing. They are a gift. They spread the word of God, and it is that which must be preserved, whatsoever the cost. I admire your resolve. But unless the Red Hand is dismantled, they will continue to harm those in possession of these texts. The Red Hand seems to know where to look for these texts. It may be someone is guiding them. What can you tell me? You know something else. That much is clear. The Abbess has her suspicions. As much as it pains me to say, I suspect something foul at the Rectory. I have heard whispering, collusion, and the Bishop. He has been sneaking around the Rectory, often visiting the priests in the cover of night. Time I pay these men of faith a visit. The Rectory is on the road to the Minister. I should look for the Bishop there. I have the Yuletide feast to prepare for as well. Uh, do drop by for the festivities, A4. Have a drink or two.
Dag var et skipasmid slæn på en medium vej. the rectory. The abbess said she suspected secrecy among the priests and bishop. Seems quiet. Where is everyone? What has you doused in sweat and trembling so? The, the Red Hand. They're everywhere. Please, I don't want any trouble. Looks as though everyone else has fled this place. So why are you still here? Waiting for the bishop. One of our brothers said he would return soon. That's all I know, I swear it! Where's this other priest? He's locked himself in. That house, just there.
Someone is hiding in there. Doubt he'll come out. I'll have to find a way in. Run! 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 Enum! Et per peccatum enim. No! Stay away from me! Stay back! Musky. Been here long, priest? Just who do you think you are, trespassing like this? This is my property you've destroyed. I hear you priests have been hiding ever since some Christian texts went missing. What are you hiding from? The Red Hand? Who else? They muscle their way to and fro. No one has done a thing about it. I'm looking for the bishop. Where is he? Gone to his quarters. Said he would return once he finished tending to a private matter. But that was some time ago. Show me there. Wh what do you mean to do with him? Now. Lord, forgive me. I knew I should have left with the others. <gasps> the bishop's quarters. What is that burning smell? Several Christian texts. The Abbas was right to cast suspicion the bishop's way. Blood. There was a struggle here. Charred letter beneath the body. He must have tried to hide it before he died. Oh, the stench. He looks like searcher's shit. Someone knew the bishop was conflicted and killed him before he could say a word. It's a confession. The bishop played a part in destroying these texts against his own will. The rest of the letters burned. It makes mention of the minster and the epis. Is that why she's been keeping these texts? Look around. Search every room. They're around here somewhere. It's them. It's the Red Hand. Oh, Lord of mercy! Quiet. The Red Hand. I need to leave. We will burn that sinner just like the others.
target sent the Red Hand after me. I must be closing in. It's time I head to the Minster. The Abbess knows more than she's letting on. You're doing this is no place for you priest go now blasphemy stop this at once something troubling you father abbess look they are burning all of these passages why are you not stopping this because they ordered them to what the vellum that burn before you are covered in lies. So long as they exist, you cannot hope to see the world the way it truly is. Lies? Abbas, what has happened to you? We are God's children all. Do not renounce him like this. Please, I beg of you. You can still repent. God will forgive you. You know he will. Your mind has been poisoned, but worry not. We have the antidote. We will set a new example to which all may aspire. You... you... you're mad! You won't get away with this! I won't let you... No one to tell. No one who will hear you cries. If you cannot bear to watch them burn, then you should burn with them. I want it all destroyed! Every text, every passage, every scribbled piece of paper, everything. It is time to end this. Yes, Firebrand. The Abbess is the Firebrand. She'll kill whoever stands in her way.
time I get between her and the next victim. Asked about this lamp, my friend. <laughs> but why must we burn them? The fire cleanses impurities, and it's our duty to purify the future of Jorvik. Stretch your wings, Sunan. Go, tell them the Abbas sent you, and bring the texts here at once. fire that burns inside. I've always had it. A longing to do something grand and important. But that door was always shut to me. My methods deemed too severe. I was cast out. Shunned. Scorned. But the Order, they took notice of me. Saw that it was courage that drove me. Courage to change the world for the better. They reopened that door. And you used your chance to destroy a way of life you did not support. We have seen time and time again what happens when people are left to interpret for themselves. Knowledge must be controlled. Only then can the message be widely understood. The day where there is but one truth draws nearer. One truth, that is what the Order offers. This one sought to spark a new flame, but did so with a heavy hand, not a teacher's tongue. This cleansing of yours ends here. My work is incomplete, but not inconsequential. There are others who carry on, for one of the four is us. Why did you say that? What does it mean? Now I go. A flame that grows bright and burns ever more, ever light. To 
Helheim, where cold and cruel the fires await. <laughs> 